This Excel spreadsheet shows you the weekly closing price of Bitcoin over time. So as you see here, we have the week. So this second row in the table would be the week of September 15th, 2014. And the next is the closing price of Bitcoin measured by US dollars. So one Bitcoin in this case is equal to about 399 US dollars. And then the third number is the trading volume, how many Bitcoins have been traded on that day. So this data spans from late 2014 up until the end of August 2022. And to create the chart, we're going to go to Insert, select the lower right corner here, and select All Charts. And here we want to create a combo chart. A combo chart in Excel allows us to put two types of charts together within one chart. We have closing price and volume. So we're going to use a line to demonstrate the closing price. So change this to line. And for volume and following convention, we're going to use a column to represent volume. And as you see here, this gives you a preview of the chart because the volume numbers are so much larger. So the price line is entirely collapsed at the bottom of it. It looks entirely flat because the volume numbers are much larger. These two, these two numbers are of different scales, which is why we need to put one of them onto a second scale. Let's put volume on the secondary axis and then click OK. Enlarge this and change the chart title to Bitcoin Price and Volume History 2014 to 2022. So now we can see this. Again, use a different quick layout so that it helps us read the chart easier by having column and row labels. Select this one. And uh, the horizontal axis is weak. And then the vertical axis is price. Let's add this to a dollar. As you notice that the secondary axis does not have a label. So we can go to Add Chart Elements and Access Titles, Secondary Vertical. And uh, now it appears we can add this to Volume. And you see here the volume numbers are huge and they are not easy to read. So you can change that by double clicking on the numbers of the secondary vertical axis. As you see here, we can change the display units. Right now, none means it will display the actual numbers. So we can change this to hundreds, thousands, millions, etc. Now, let's change this to millions. Numbers are still very big. So let's change this to billions. Now it's much better. So you can see that the trading volumes at the peak were happening at a scale of almost 800 billion Bitcoins per day. The legend, let's move this to a better location. Let's move the legends there. And then select the chart. We can move the charts to make it bigger. So now we have a combo chart that shows a Bitcoin trading history with price and volume together. That concludes this video.